According to the Murraysville fire chief, the driver of a tanker truck was traveling east off of Route 22 when he lost control of his vehicle and crashed into the side of Bowser Collision Center off of William Penn Highway. A semi truck, it was a water tanker, it was empty at the time. He had some difficulties coming off the highway, lost control, ended up going approximately 30 feet into the building. At the time of the crash, manager Derek Severance was inside the facility. Here's how he describes it. Just loud, uh, and then the kind of the ceiling started to fall, and they broke some water lines, so water was spraying everywhere. It was just kind of shocked. It didn't really register kind of even what happened. I mean, you knew what happened, but it just kind of didn't really register. The crash not compromising the integrity of the building, but the fire chief says the company will have to rebuild the entire office space. Mostly it's it's a lot of cosmetic stuff. Uh, the, the exterior wall obviously needs to be replaced. The entire office space in the front of the building here was damaged. Uh, the sprinklers were activated when the truck went in, so it caused quite a bit of water damage as well. There. Bystanders hearing the commotion and stunned by the damage left behind. I've, I've seen cars and buildings. My dad's been a police officer for th over 30 years, so I've definitely seen things like this, but never a tanker or anything of this magnitude. Now, only one person was transported from the scene to the hospital, and that was the driver of the truck as a precaution. Thankfully, none of the workers were inside the area where the crash happened at that time. Reporting from Murraysville, Yasmin Rodriguez, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.